In the previous part of the tutorial really we have learned how to set up the admin dashboard and in this part we will deal on the car screen. We will use we will use some model to insert new cars using bootstrap model and jQuery. So the first thing to do is to get to add some link on this button click for the cars. So let's go back to our project and let's see the cars in the header include. And here it is it will not call the, the car HTML, it will call something that we will call cars and give the extension PHP. And now exit the, con the include file folder and create a new file in the admin folder that you will call cars PHP. And inside this card PHP, you need to need to do take the same thing in the index, copy all, go to cars, and pass all. And here is not blank page. You need to change to change something. Is not here is not dashboard. Is cars. And here we will not say upload to pro. We will add something new different we say that add new car okay now now you go to your browser and you refresh and now if you press on car you will fall on this let's say that you don't it doesn't see our reviews why it doesn't see our reviews let's go back to the folder and go to the header and what and right now what okay I, I have type the wrong URL in my case cast of PHP so we should you need you to make cast PHP so now let's go to the car screen and here inside it's not blank page here is cast and this I don't know what this means so I want to remove it and we need to leave it he has he has his job he do his job so let's leave it empty okay so now is we have a screen and when we want we want something that if we click on this add new car a pop-up will appear so first thing to search you go to is to go to search bootstrap model you need to search this first and when you search bootstrap model you fall and you click on the first link and the first thing you will see how it works how it work and take the first one that you follow on it i will copy this one and come back to your car screen just reduce all thing and pass the card model and give it the ID of of car model okay it's the first thing the second thing is that this this template that we insert have already bootstrap integrated but we want to use some different version of bootstrap to use the card so let's go back here and let's see bootstrap bootstrap cdn so we use bootstrap cdn and we will use one version for a css and one version for this gs so let's go css let's copy the css folder and we will not pass it in the either because i think it will make some problem so we will pass it directly in the car screen and let's do the same thing for the javascript part and copy the same thing and now go bottom Put on the footer and 
write script source because we don't want to have some conflict and now let's come back and refresh if all things work again i think it will work okay all, all things work but you notice that the design will be uh, broken because we integrated a new version of postra and this is not good it's thing like this that i will want to avoid so i will deal with it later so for make our thing let's open the script tag and let's say that you want to open a function to start our with our jquery and this one is for initialize jquery and the first thing that you want to check is to check if we press on open modal button so the button we we will give we need to give it a class of open car modal and we will use a click event and we need to give this class this open car modal to the button that we want to use and in our case the button is in the page breakdown the button is this one let's add a class here and replace let's delete the link we don't need it let's remove it and replace it with a div and let's refresh to see if all things work no all things will not work so let's add a again and let's add the href of something empty let's check why this doesn't work again let me see the default appearance we have some default class is for this reason so we need to make this one blank this one blank now replace this by, by a div and add our card at the end okay now the thing is that when we click on this we want to have to open our model so let me close this and now and now we need to take our model id name and in our case is cast model and we go bottom and we have a click function and inside this we need to call the model with the id and add the model and say that we want to show the model if all things is good it will work if not we have we need a something and then click on this and the model appear good and now with the next thing that i want to verify is the dashboard is the design let me remove the post traveling that we add and check if all will work again okay now let's click on add new car the model still appears so we know we don't need the second link of the design and this doesn't work too because it's the wrong version of postra but we will deal with it later but now we have some add new card which appears okay so now let's go to the design and let's say that we have some we want to 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 register a new card for the car we have how can we deal with this no first thing
add new car and and let me check if you remove this version of of post wrap to does it work again okay it still works so we don't need we don't need to integrate the two version of bootstrap or jQuery so you just remove remove this and in this new in the, in the next part we will deal on the screen of the pop-up model to display the cards field to validate the card and save it in the database so thank you for watching and see you in the next video